I still can't understand it. Somehow I managed to oversleep. And on the big day! Luckily, I arrived right on the money. It was some big deal. They were opening the tomb of some big shot pharaoh. The kids had given up their summer vacation to come and help the professor. Just think, this tomb has remained undisturbed for thousands of years. <laughs> this is exciting. I'm all a quiver. Who knows what lies behind these doors? Untold treasures, <laughs> perhaps. Oh, great! Mysteries! I hate mysteries. Laugh trap, shush. Just open the tomb, you silly little man. Sir Alistair Loveless was a big mucky muck from the London Museum. But he sure smelled like trouble. Per Absen, a king from the Second Dynasty. Wonderful! At last. Oh, what a find! Who knows how many years of human history we've uncovered here today! Uh, Professor, um, I, I, I seem to, uh, uh, that is... Owen, don't juggle those funerary jars! We must respect these ancient relics. Er, uh, maybe we should get out of the way for a while. Uh, good idea. You kids can come back tomorrow. This is astounding! Per Absen was believed to be aligned with Set, the ancient Egyptian embodiment of chaos. It is even more astounding than your limited perception could ever imagine, Doctor. Ever since I was a poor child on the streets of London, I've dreamed of finding this sort of power. Quickly now, load everything into the trucks, including my esteemed colleague. Soon, my friend, the world will know the power of Set and the genius of me, Alistair Loveless. Ooh, there are so many evil things for us to do. <laughs> Something was up. I had that feeling I get right before an earthquake. The kids had other things to worry about. Well, Joni, I guess this makes you an international jewel thief. Can you at least pretend you're helping, Santiago? I cannot get this thing off. It feels like it's holding onto my finger. Maybe it likes you, Joni. It looks like some sort of ceremonial ring. You'd better let Professor Botch know you have it. Okay, Leslie, I'll tell him tomorrow. But it's so embarrassing. I never should have touched this ring in the first place. We didn't know it then, but Egypt was about to get a lot harder than usual. You want to know what happens? Well, before you go on, you must use the keyboard and sign your name on this piece of paper. I hate being right all the time, but my instincts told me something bad would happen, and boy did it ever. We'd all gone back to the dig early, but the place was deserted. Everything's gone. Where's the professor? How'd they get all that stuff out of here without being seen? Probably an inside job. And I had a pretty good idea who was behind it. I've got a feeling the professor is in trouble. We've got to help him. How are we going to do that, Joni? We needed a lucky break. Something left behind, or... Socrates found a hidden door. Good boy. I wonder what it is. Oh, Egyptian kings were always buried with spells of protection and other important writings. 
This one was hidden away from the other treasures, so it must be very important. And it's our only clue. How can we read it? We need to find someone to translate this scroll. Let's put it in the backpack and get back to Cairo. This mystery could spell trouble. If you're in a jam and you need help, just ask me. I'm here for you. And if you need to know where you are, or you want to take a break, use me. Come on, Clue Finders, let's roll. Welcome to the desert's hottest Jeep dealership. You folks look like you're on your way to Cairo. Am I right? Why, yes. Have I got a deal for you. You can pick any one of my beautiful Jeeps, but only one can make it to Cairo. Multiply the two numbers on the sign above a Jeep to find out how far that Jeep can travel. The sign pointing to Cairo tells you how far you need to travel. Pick the Jeep you want when you're ready to go. Click on my button. Click on a number to set an activity to that level. Click the checkboxes to turn automatic leveling off. Step aside, give me the wheel, lap traps in charge. Where to now? We have to find someone who can translate the scroll. Meow. Stop. No. That dog. Socrates, come here. Lucky for us, the place is empty. Oh boy, customers. I didn't hear you come in. Sorry about that. You caught me napping. When you're 5,000 years old, you need lots of rest. 5,000 years old? Wait a minute. Hey, if you're so old, do you recognize this? Hmm, this. This, as a matter of fact, this scroll tells of an ancient evil. I knew the professor was in trouble. Whoever took your professor is up to no good. He wants to unleash the power of Set, the ancient Egyptian embodiment of chaos. Oh, great! I hate chaos. How can we stop him? Legend has it that the ancients built a mysterious place of power. Those worthy enough to enter would be granted the power needed to stop Set. This scroll has five clues that will guide you on your first step toward locating this place of power. But wait, the clues are written in an ancient code. I can't read this without chiroglyphs. Oh, chiroglyphs. What are chiroglyphs? Ancient pottery pieces with letters carved upon them. Bring me back 12 chiroglyphs, and I'm sure I can decipher the first clue. But where can we find these mysterious chiroglyphs? Hey, you're the clue finders, not me. But it shouldn't be too hard. Luckily, this is the chiroglyph district. Everyone around here collects chiroglyphs. You can count on us. <laughs> Those kids are going to do fine. Guess we better go find those chiroglyphs. This here is a map of Cairo. You can use it to travel to other places in Cairo, as long as you've been to those places before.
Thank heavens you're here. Customers all over the world are clamoring for my goods, and my atlas has vanished. Can you help me get these parcels out? We'd be happy to help you, ma'am. Especially if you can help us out with a couple of chiroglyphs. Very well, then. For every two packages you help me ship, I will give you a chiroglyph. Read the directions on the package and tag. Then use the pin to show the parcel's correct destination on the map. You are such a help to me! Excellent! Here we go again! You are such a help to me! Your skill is exceptional! Here we go again! You are such a help to me! Your skill is exceptional! I'm all out of chiroglyphs, but I could still use your help. You are such a help to me! Are you sure? My customers will be delighted. Dude, I wonder if there are any chiroglyphs hidden in all this cloth. Cloth? Hello, this is fabric. It's gorgeous. I've got customers all over Cairo screaming for it, but they always tell me how much to cut as a fraction problem. Check out the request on the sign. It's your turn to do the math, for a chiroglyph, of course. Cut off just the right amount from one of these four bolts of fabric hanging off the top shelf. Just move my scissors over the fabric. When the piece is exactly the right length, let go of the scissors to cut it. Awesome! Here's a chiroglyph. No way! Another order? Uh-uh! Since the two fractions in the... I am so in awe of you. You rule. Could you, like, totally handle this for me? You rock. You roll. You make fractions from a whole. That was my last chiroglyph. I am so bummed.
Excuse me, dude. I mean, uh, sir. We're looking for some chiroglyphs. Do you know where we might find any? Today's your lucky day. I have my old collection right here in the shop. Help my way to deliver the right amount of coffee, and I'll give you a glyph. Read the question on the sign. Then place cups that add up to the correct answer on the waiter's tray. You can make the correct answer using two or three cups. You sure got the hang of this business. Take this here glyph. Okay now, pile the coffee on. You kids sure know your math. You deserve a chiroglyph. Uh, wake up, kids. Here we go again. Hey, how about we trade hot coffee for your hard work, huh? Oh, okay, okay, take this here glyph. Well, that's it. I'm all out of Kyra glyphs for now. You whippersnappers don't Ah, what have we here? Visitors. I hear you're looking for chiroglyphs. Well, you've come to the right place. Read the question on the banner. Then drag the stone with the correct answer from the wall onto the sled. Every time you answer two questions, I'll give you a chiroglyph. Ha ha ha! You are very wise for being so young. Here is a chiroglyph for you. <laughs> <laughs> 